my ducks in a row, but anyway. Um, but I wrote this song called Simple and Sweet. As a songwriter, sometimes it's get a lot of pressure of, uh, I start thinking about the people who are listening to the song too much. Like, is this too long for radio? Is this got anything that's weird? Is it like too metaphorical? And uh, blah, 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 blah. And I just, my songwriting process is me just being quiet and letting a song pass through me. I'm not a uh, studied, uh, there's no formula really. <laughs> so anyway, this sweet little song came to me when I was sitting on my couch with my little dog looking at our Christmas tree. And I was just thinking about the sweet and simple things. And this song is called Simple and Sweet. Facebook live, uh, I guess maybe a week ago or so, I, I played a little clip of that out on the, um, Jake, the sweet fellow that introduced us, he was telling, begging me like, come on, man, we got to do some promo for the festival, and I want you to do a live video out there on that mountain that you live on, and, you know, mountain life's hard, I got to, you know, chase that sweet six-year-old girl around, and got to go up to the spring and blow the crawdads out of the spring water, and chop wood oh the wood pile was looking low when we left and it was 30 this morning when we get back so we're gonna take all the warmth that we get from our our uh, swanee set and bring it back home Stronger wind that 
lonesome railroad line And I put you aside and looking back Small town you left behind And there's nothing that's as clear as This love in my mind So close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning Close your eyes, I'll be here for a while Close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning Close your eyes, I'll be here for a while Mountains and rivers and valleys Honey, they can't compare To that blue dancing in your eyes And that shining yellow Just leave you lying there So close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning Close your eyes, I'll be here for a while Close your eyes, I'll be here in the morning Close your eyes crying eyes Honey, I'll be there to meet you when the sun comes up to rise And as long as that old cuckoo wails and my lonesome jaybird cries Close your eyes I'll be here in the morning Close your eyes I'll be here for a while really lucky just to like be alive and be here right now and experiencing all this are we all on the same level here? I'm just I mean I my eyes are closed I hear my sweet honey of 25 years over here my daughter's over there in the cooler I guess getting water <laughs> and I'm looking out and I'm seeing all you beautiful people and your my, my friends my family have been coming here 
since 97, and I worked at the kids' tent with my friend Tanya, Miss Tania, and uh, she, she and I were the only girls in the, uh, the Brevard College guitar class. And, uh, <clears throat> and uh, she had a 10,000 Maniac sticker on her guitar case, and we started chatting, and we were like, hey, da, da, da. and so she was like, I'm doing this festival, you should come down, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, it was awesome, and um, like I said, I've been coming since 97, and I, um, I was there at the kids' tent for a while, and Randy saw me play at the Mill Top in St. Augustine, and he was like, hey, we got to get you on the stage sometime, and I was like, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> can you say that again into this microphone, and I can record it and hold you to that? So I stalked him for a couple months, and <laughs> But, um, and we've been very, very lucky, and I've been so lucky to bring my family, my mom, my dad, my sister, my brother, um, and now my daughter. I actually had to skip a Roots Fest one year because she's born during Roots, and I'm sure there's, I love seeing the birthdays that happen during the festivals, although it's kind of tricky sometimes because, you know, a kid, and she's got all these grown-up friends around her, and, you know, <laughs> you know, it's, it's not like all the plastic crap that she wants, it's like, you know another tie-dyed t-shirt <laughs> from the, like anyway no but um it, it's a uh, it's just such a blessing for me to be able to have seen so many families grow and it's funny we actually met our old, our old drummer we were he was sitting at the playground in the swing and it's like times have changed he's down there with his son and i just i love seeing the new generation of extremely talented and um and just beautiful beautiful festival babies and festival families. And speaking of festival family, holy moly, you know, you don't choose your kids. You don't choose your bloodline, but I have found some of the most amazing humans. The festival family, those are the people that you call when your ship is sinking. And I've been so blessed to be welcomed into a, several circles of uh, the beautiful humans like you guys. So this place, ah, okay, all the feels. Let me get all that out, okay. I'm either gonna have a shit eating grin all day or I'll be crying because I'm so happy. So just let me go. Let me... <laughs> all right, I'm gonna sing this little song for one of my favorite captains of the sea. Um, my friend put us on some grouper one day and we had just such an amazing fishing trip and I had to, I had to keep this song, I had to write this song so I could keep reliving that day out on the water. It's called Let's Go Out on the Water. Man. 
does tomorrow Well, I'll sing the working man's blues I don't care where I'll end up or what's gonna happen But I'm taking with me some memories Captain, can't for that I'll always thank you Days like today I wish would never end And I'm proud to call you a damn good friend Oh, let's go out on the water Yeah, let's go out on the water Let's go out on the water Honey, let's go out on the water Honey, let's go Honey, let's go Thank you. <clears throat> oh, man. Just turn that damn tablet down. I'm teasing. <coughs> I'm teasing. <laughs> hey, you want to do this one? <laughs> uh, all right. So uh, this song is a newer one. It's called uh, I Would Wait For You. It's about me. I wrote a little song for Jason and... Uh, he used to drive six hours across the state of North Carolina to come see me. That's what being 20 years old will do to you. <laughs> You're that crazy. But anyway, 20, 25, 26 years later, we're still uh, hanging tough. I'm very... And it works because he lives at six hours away. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you wish. <laughs> We met in the middle, yeah, anyway. Uh, but yeah, the song is called I Would Wait For You. Tonight's one of those nights that brings full on memory of you driving across the state or oh, just to see me out in the moonlight, out in the yard, in my wine stained nightgown, strumming my guitar. Tonight it's not just me Who's dreaming of you I've had some dreams of my own But they simply fell through Ah, oh, but just how long and hard is that road And baby, what does it take? I'd like to sit here in a wonder now the baby's away
fallen And orange is my favorite And you give me all the love But you never say it This is a little song about a girl who jumps on a ship to hang out with this guy, and um, it doesn't work out, and uh, the ship sinks. It's a really uplifting number to start your Sunday off with. So anyway, it's a very old song. It's called House Carpenter, and uh, my mom taught it to me a long, long time ago, and I love being able to take her songs with me wherever I go to. I'm going to try to drag her butt back down here in October, see her again. So and even drag her on stage with me. She's a fantastic singer, songwriter, and a musician, and she's kind of wild, though. I gotta keep tabs on her. She's not allowed to be left unsupervised, man, I'm telling you. I learned from the best. <laughs> Return from the salty sea all for the love of a dear. He said I could have married a king's daughter fair. She would have married me. Oh, but I did forsake her crown. But I have six ships sailing on the sea. Sailing from dry land. Oh, and a hundred and twenty jolly young men. They'll all be at your command. Then she. that old house carpenter and you keep him company Not been a 
Eva keeps requesting to come sing on stage, okay? <laughs> I mean, I promise I won't harmonize with you. We're, get, we're getting close. We're getting close to getting the harmonies down. But uh, <laughs> I realized that um, it was funny. One of the first times she ever was um, on stage, she, um, she was a little timid, but then she heard the people, everyone clap, and she went, and I was like, oh, no. <laughs> She's got it. Oh, dear. <laughs> anyway, um, this, is a, this is a song I wrote for her, of course, and uh, it's called Blue-Eyed Girl. Sun is bright, the sky is blue, the birds are singing as if they knew you were mine. You have saw my past The days go on forever But 
The years have flown by fast with you. My blue eyed girl. Yeah, my blue eyed girl. Yeah, my blue. She gets that for me, sorry. <laughs> All right, we're gonna. Uh, this is our last set of the weekend, and uh, we are staying tonight. So we might see if we can uh, go storm a stage somewhere, or sit around and pick a little bit around the campfire. I love. That's what half of the fun is. The music that's made at the camps, man. Woo, love it, love it, love it. But anyway, here's a little song uh, called Mockingbird. Stafford.
pour sand out my feet And the ocean still fresh All my breath Just hoping I could find you And kiss on your face Hey, y'all give it up for Jason Sharp over here. Well, don't give it up. I mean, he's married, but anyway. It, it's a Sunday G-rated show. I should, com I should calm down a little bit. This microphone is a tricky situation. Yes, bad words. My daughter started, I'm telling you, man, if I had a swear jar... I'd be passing a plate like every song like, for my for Eva's future college fund. She's already got a full ride to wherever she wants to go. Anyway, no. Um, <clears throat> but was what was awesome is she started also saying, "Good word." So every time I'd say a bad word, then we were like riding around. She was like, "Good word, good word." And then I realized I talk a lot. <laughs> good, good word, good word. She warbles when she flies, but she'll never uh -uh, holler cuckoo till that fourth day of July. Jack of diamonds, yeah, Jack of diamonds, honey, I know. pockets of my silver and my gold. I'm gonna build me a log cabin up on the mountain so high so that I can see my darling when he goes right on by. 
Oh, the cuckoo, she's a pretty bird. Yeah, she warbles when she flies, but she'll never holler cuckoo till the fourth day of July. In the summertime and apples in the fall If I can't have what I love I don't want none at all Shady Grove, she's my little love Standing in the door With her shoes and stockings And her head and little bad feet on the floor Oh, the higher up that cherry tree Ripe grows the berry And the more you hug and kiss the girls Sooner they marry Shady Grove, my little love Shady Grove, I say Shady my little love, you're bound to go away. Joe and we'll get Jason Sharp back up here and uh Just lay down in clover. I'd only work on Christmas Day and all the rest go sporting. Take my days down by the creek and every night I go courting. Yeah, and I'd get my honey from the honeycomb, water from the fountain, sugar from the sugar cane. Honey, I'd fill it all up with feathers And I'd take my Johnny by the hand And we'd lay down together All those nights when I was young Thoughts keep returning And they melt these winter nights away Just like a log fire burning Yeah, and I'll get my honey from the honeycomb The water from the fountain Sugar from the sugar cane Sipping on whiskey, whiskey from the white oak barrel sure makes good liquor. You know it makes the night seem twice as bright. Them days go by much quicker, and I get my honey from the honeycomb, water from the fountain, the sugar from the sugar cane. Sugar from the sugar cane Wild rose Of the mountain Thank you! Jay 
Congratulations, Thank Sharp, up here for this last tune here. Song. Let me go warm up, do some vocal exercises for you now. No, I do all the wrong things. I think that's what, that's what my uh, songwriter workshop would be. It would be like, so first of all, become an addict of some sort, have a really awful relationship, and then come back and write a bunch of songs about that crappy relationship and your self-doubt, and stay up all night around a campfire, hanging out with people, and screaming, and hooting, and hollering, and never give yourself vocal rest, and drink liquor, and blow fire around the campfire. <laughs> you shouldn't drink flammable stuff. I don't know why we do, but we do. Anyway. No, I, I, I'm very, very lucky. I have been lucky, and I, rest is the biggest, and that's like any, any illness. Like, and who does that <laughs> ever, especially at a festival? I'm like, oh, no. You know, I, 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 I'm not a, um, I don't do a lot of drugs, and uh, I'm serious. I'm just nuts as it is. However, I'm not going to get arrested for this story, I promise. She does a medium amount of drugs. Not a lot, but just a medium. I'm kidding. Anyway, like what? Like a meprazole? Is that considered a drug for heartburn? Anyway, no, I, 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 I've got these amazing neighbors across the street from me, and they have Irish coffees going all the time. And you don't need, they're not shots. Why did I, you don't need a 16 ounce, ugh. anyway. So everyone probably thought I ran into a little something, something hanging out with me while I got jacked up on caffeine and whiskey. And <laughs> I'm enough as it is, okay? But anyway, I did not do anything illegal. Well, never mind. Here's a spiritual for you. Sorry, I just had to get that out. I'm a poet, wayfaring stranger. And I'm a traveling through. Yeah, this world of a world. There's no sickness, I toil or danger.
Nikki Tally, we love y'all. Have a great day.